Continuing on the wave of the new female action hero, Drew Barrymore leaped, kicked and wise-talked her way to box office success with the Charlie's Angels movies, a remake of the popular 70s television series. I'm keeping him. At just seven, Drew became a celebrity thanks to her role as Gertie in Steven Spielberg's timeless classic E.T. the Extraterrestrial. The huge success of the 1982 film endeared the adorable Drew to millions of audience members. You should be good. Heir to a Hollywood dynasty, Drew moved from child star to a mature and dedicated actress, managing to reinvent herself after falling foul of Hollywood stardom and the pressures exerted on young stars. A pretty girl asks three handsome guys questions and she picks one to date. That's it, that's the show. Drew received the honor of a star on the Walk of Fame in Hollywood in 2004 to her fans' great delight, a testament to her talent and style. In 2004, Drew starred opposite Adam Sandler in the romantic comedy Fifty First Dates. Are you staring at me or her? Because you're starting to freak me out. Oh, Henry Roth, nice to meet you. Whoa, Amber is the color of your inner... Drew starred in the romantic comedy The Perfect Catch with Jimmy Fallon about a guy whose life revolves around baseball. It's good for your soul to invest in something you can't control. You're a romantic. The documentary My Date with Drew was released in 2005 and tells the story of 27-year-old Brian Herzlinger's lifelong dream of a date with Drew. My Date with Drew. Drew Barrymore, from child star to superstar, for this young actress, the only way is up.